Hey, you still there? Yeah, okay. God. Really aggravates me. Really aggravates me. Hopefully we can figure this out because now I'm distracted and <sighs> yeah, let's just reset. I wasn't paying attention. Uh... Okay. So I think now it needs to go this way first. And then this way, and then up again. No, because then if I flip it, it won't work. Nope, that's not what I wanted. Okay, so. Mm -hmm. Mm -hmm. Don't know how many people I lost because it's telling me I have zero people watching now. But I see one's okay, so... Alright, so we got that one. Now we just gotta figure out which path this one takes. Let's start with all of them. Let's go this way. This way. This way. This way. This way. And this way. Oh, look, I think I got it. Cool. Man, that interrupting the stream really freaking bothers me. Because it was going good. Oh. I hate it. Absolutely hate it. Another conundrum solved. Just imagine what you could accomplish if you actually knew each other longer than... How long has it been? 18 years. Give or take a few key moments. Oh, wait. That's how long you've been apart. Apologies. Sometimes I mix up numbers and dates. looks really hard. Please don't. I can't help it! Oh, come on, Dad. This is really embarrassing. Oh, no. How many switches are in this trap? Is this the final gauntlet? Have we reached the end? Will we make it out alive? Will we use our bows? Does this labyrinth give out prizes? Oh, 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 what if the prizes are custom jackets? Can ours say the dueling archers, please? When can we schedule a pun war? How about every day that ends in Y? Isn't this so much fun? Aren't you excited you're back? Cause I am. What size crown do you wear? When do you want to begin addendum training? Tell me, are you more the brave, the wise, or the compassionate? You can choose how to solve this conundrum as long as we do it together! Yes! Why would you do that? It looked like so much fun. I'm not like you. I can't handle any more puzzles. That magic is dangerous. See? This is what I warned you about. That snapping. That horrendous snapping. It's what took you away from us. And I... I forbid you to use it. Forbid me? This magic is part of who I am. I just wish you could see that. Look. We're not some happy family just because I'm back. I wasn't there on your adventures. I don't know what the tapestries that line the walls mean, and I... I don't know why you insist on wearing that ridiculous hat. Well, if you didn't want a family, then why did you come back? I was looking for a father, not a commander. I'm not one of your subjects to be ruled over. If I wanted to be a slave, I would have stayed with Mananin. Please don't ever 
compare me to that man. He robbed you of your childhood. Well, like it or not, Dad, I'm already grown up. And you're robbing me of my adulthood. You shouldn't talk to your father that way, Alexander. Look, I don't even know that name. Let's just split up and search for the girls. You have your way of doing things, and I have mine. I'm just slowing you down. Fine, leave again. You know what? You are slowing me down. Ah, uh, whatever. I'm tired of this chapter. I'm ready to move on. It's my least favorite chapter. Should we? save a plate for dad I brought him food earlier he refused to eat he's too preoccupied with this next pig adventure he's cooking up in his head you know that's just like dad once adventure is on his mind he can't focus on anything else he's never lost his drive you have to give him that well I've never regretted retiring my questing boots it allowed me to devote my full attention to raising my daughter isn't that right, my little cuddle bug? <laughs> Dad, stop. You're embarrassing me. Oh, come now, Alexander. We were raised going on adventures, and we turned out just fine. Well, you know what I mean. Oh, look at Gart. He's been questing since he could crawl, and shaping up to be quite the handsome prince, if I do say so myself. Well, thanks for saying so, Mother. Oh, I do hope you decide to take Gwendolyn on her own adventure soon. She's got it in her blood. You can't keep her safe forever. <laughs> she can go out questing for danger when she's older. We like to do things a little differently in the Green Isles. You can say that again. Not enough addendums and far too few decrees. <clears throat> Pardon the interruption, milady. I see. Thank you. God? The chambermaid found this crumbled up in your waste bin. I am assuming it fell. Yes. Um, thank the shining stars they found it. I was looking all over for that. It must have blown right off my desk. <laughs> g g give it here. I'll, I'll deliver it right after supper. No need. I'll deliver it myself in the morning. Guard, I told you to keep the windows closed in your room. <laughs> it's so breezy in there. <laughs> Can you please pass the peas? Gart, did you not hear Gwendolyn? Oh, apologies. I thought that was a nint mouse squeaking in the courtyard. What did you say? <clears throat> I asked you to please pass Gart. the... Please pass the peas to your cousin. The little highness can reach them herself. I'm not here to serve her. You would be honored to serve. Children, that's enough. There you go, dear. Or was that so hard? Now, can we just finish up dinner in peace? Grandpa would like to speak with everyone after dinner. Ugh, I hate the smell of that lavender. When I'm king, we will never serve those abominations again. Oh, do tell us, God. What qualities do you possess that would make for a good king? Well, for one, I've been raised in this castle and trained to properly take over the kingdom. Unlike some other children who have only had adventures in their imaginations. Boys! I don't like where this conversation is going. Daventry is our home, Alexander. You chose to run away with the princess and rule over her kingdom. Who else besides Gart would make a good king? <laughs> I don't know. I hear Kyle has some big ideas. Kyle? Really? Uh, Uncle, you're acting like a buffoon. Well, if this is how children raised by royalty treat their elders, then I'm proud that Gwendolyn and I grew up outside these castle walls. What? So now your family is too good for Daventry? It would be an honor for me to be king. But for you, it's just a burden? Knock it off, Gart! No! You're just a little girl. Nothing more than a dreamer. If you didn't encourage Grandfather's ramblings, he might actually notice that I am the only man for the job. Sit down. You're embarrassing the family. Ah! You will never be half the king Grandpa is. 
And he would never, ever leave the kingdom to such a spoiled, thoughtless child. I may be a little girl, but you're the one that needs to grow up. Ah, uh, distress. I think it would be best to cool off in your rooms. Everybody. No one is allowed to see Grandpa until you can all get along. Grandpa? Can I come in? Gwendolyn, you've disobeyed your grandma by sneaking in here. I was told everyone was sentenced to their chambers. Do you know what that means? That I should go back to my room, take this time to reflect in my journal. No, it means you should pull up a chair, and I can finish this story without any more interruptions. I think I crossed a line tonight. Well, I'm sure you did. Good thing this story is all about crossing lines. <laughs> All right, let's get in here and figure this out. You'll find this puzzle is easier without all that extra weight, Mr. Majesty. Pretty sure this is it. Could be wrong though. Let's flip it up and figure it out. I'm just ready to get done with this. Move on. Almost got it. And I don't have the right piece for that either. Alright, so let's put this down, get that other corner. Yep, it's gonna have to be this one right here. You just make a mirror each other, and boom, there you go. Alright. <laughs> the we did a run through of this and uh I thought you had to connect all three of them and it's impossible. Alright, so run up here. Do that. I hate to say it, but this is so much easier alone. Cool, got it. Alright, so we got that bit, but I'm pretty sure there's more pieces. So 
I'm gonna come up here and go up. Don't worry, Mr. Majesty, he'll learn his lesson. Such a shame how parents treat their kids these days. Okay. Evidently it's this. Ah, uh, yeah. Okay. So, this needs to go here. Mm, I need all of this unblocked. Which means that... Oops. Nope. This puzzle's light on teenage angst. I appreciate that. And so that comes down to here. And then goes over there. Hmm. Wait, I, I think I got it. Hold on. Here, there, there, and there. Nailed it. Okay, so we come down here. Pop the thing on there. And the head. But yeah. I wish I could just snap and bring you to the end of the labyrinth, but alas, I lack opposable thumbs. I'm afraid you'll just have to solve this on your own. I don't mean to salt a wound, but are you even sure that he's your son? It's not like you're cut from the same cloth. How do you know this Alexander is not a man? Yeah. I almost wished I had Alexander's fire to solve this one. But I would get through it without any dark magic. It's also not the same puzzle, so... This thing was originally right here, so... That changes everything. Hold on, there's a way to do this. Well, what was it? Let me start over. I tried. I almost wished I had Alexander's fire to solve this one. But I would get through it without any dark magic. Yeah, I think it's different now.
Yeah, I think I know. There you go. needed to solve this. It was a different puzzle, so no. This this chapter goes on just a little too long for my liking. But how did you resolve your fight? I need some tips to get Gart to be nicer to me. Are you sure something else isn't bothering him? Have you tried asking him? Or are you assuming? It has to do with you. Well, he's cordial to everyone else. I might dig a little deeper into that. <sighs> now there's this multi-tiered one that just takes so much time because you got to go up and down and up and down. Okay. This one might be a little easier with two people. Okay, let's go down and see what that's done. Such a pain in the butt, oh my god. Oh, just climbed down already.
eight, so it's going to go, okay. Okay, so some help on this would have been nice. Might have saved my back a bit. <laughs> I guess I gotta go up top. I don't know. God, this is so dumb. Why is it this complicated? Go, go, go down. Gotta have a cutscene for every freaking time. Nope, that wasn't it. And I froze. Are you hungry? Should I continue? Or shall we have a lunch first? Okay. <sighs> really trying to figure this one out because it can't go anywhere. I thought I had it. Um... sense it's on So I gotta go down and make sure that they're going that way, blah, 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 blah. 
Okay, this one might be a little easier with two people. God, just drop down. Okay. Okay, so I need to in that one because when I run on it, I'm going to go here and I'm going to bounce here and then I got to spin this one. So then I'll go this way and I got to turn this one so that I'll go that way. All right, I think I got it. Okay, so some help on this would have been nice. Might have saved my back a bit. Ugh, all right, please let this be it. This is great and all, but are you sure Gart shouldn't be listening to this? He's the one who started it all. He needs to apologize. It's not always about who's right and who started it, Gwendolyn. Have you tried approaching Gart calmly? You might be surprised what you find. Welcome to the Riddle Room. This is my favorite puzzle. Probably because I helped design it. Great. <clears throat> what am I? I have a head but no arms to flail. I have no legs yet I have a tail. Hmm. Hmm. Did you need the riddle again? <clears throat> Thank you, bring it back here, yeah. That golden arrow is <laughs> You are correct. But it won't be that easy. I've got another riddle for you in here. Proceed. What am I? Every morning a noggin I shed, and every evening I regain my head. Well, I'd love to give you the answer, but I'm a stickler for the rules. Two down, but we're just getting started. A word back here, please. Go for it. What <laughs> am I? I come in different colors. I come in different shapes. Some parts of me are round. Some parts of me are straight. Our picture can be clear, but we love to obfuscate. Grandpa, do you think I'm ready for my first adventure? Of course, dear. But uh, <laughs> not without your father's permission, of course. Still need more time? It's not like your family is waiting or anything. I only needed to carry one item at a time, so I put one back. I'm pretty sure it's the puzzle piece.
Bravissimo. But the show is hardly over. Let me have it. What am I? I am fit for a king and taste very sweet. Thick or thin served for breakfast, Graham's favorite treat. I'm pretty sure that's it. Hmm. I don't remember eating that today. <sighs> Frying pan because of the chocolate chip pancakes. Open the door. Nope, that wasn't that one. Are you just choosing things at random? I was hoping. Wait. I got you. I'll put this other item back. I know how to do this. Yep. It is pancakes, but there aren't pancakes. But we have a pan and we have cakes. So, pancakes. Booyah. For some reason, I can only carry one item at a time. So, I have to annoyingly run back and forth. And we no, go up here. This room. Cakes. Pancakes. <laughs> Nailed it. One final riddle, if you would. What am I? I am higher than the shining stars and greater than the land or sea. What's the one thing that's worth breaking the bonds of family? This one's a trick, because the answer is nothing. So you just run over here and pop open that door. Hmm, I have to admit I'm surprised you got that one right. You should really practice what that riddle teaches. Wow. was right. I needed to rethink this puzzle of parenting. Excellent work, Mr. Majesty. You are a natural. Wonderful. Someone had removed all the pieces from the board. I'd have to puzzle out the path. Lucky for me, it appeared all the pieces were already set in their proper rotation. Okay, I got you. Uh, nope, that wasn't it. You're just a few steps away from your family now. I wouldn't expect anything less from the hero of Daventry. Dang it. Okay, here. Okay, I'm gonna head to myself. What? Uh...
Ah, mm. Dang it! It's hard, like the angles are jacking with me. Okay. Oh my god. Okay. Oh my gosh, I stepped on, ooh. Congratulations, God. Graham. You have won the labyrinth. You may now claim your prizes inside. I know this episode is going on long, but I, uh, uh, I kind of let it go long because of the whole streaming interruption issue and all that. But I'm going to take a break right here. I'll be back in about five-ish minutes to start the next episode. But for the sake of YouTube stuff, if you like what you saw, guys, uh, and you finding, you're finding this on YouTube, be sure to subscribe to me on Twitch. Just search Ram Crown. It should pop right up. Also, if you're finding this on YouTube, give us a like and maybe subscribe so you can keep watching all of our stuff. Uh, until next time, which is not far from now, may your beards be long and your drinks be endless. See you later.